DJ Scream. <laughs> Man, Hello, love. Welcome to an interview conducted by the likes of the wonderful publication known as Ass Magazine. Today, we'll be interviewing one of the most obscure thou artists in modern times, modern day very prolific homadic artist by the name of John Lemison. So join us further as we conduct this in-depth interview into the character and the trials and tribulations of such a wonderful, wonderful thou artist. Join me, loves, will you? Please have a seat and we'll get right into it. To le plaisir is pure moi. Thank you for having me. Oh yes, I saw that. Congratulations, you are on Google. I don't know them personally, but it's real nice. I'm just happy someone keeps thou art and it created a smile. Well, the, uh, the first drawing I remember making was of the Joker. It, it, I was trying to impress my family. My older, cooler cousin drew a Batman and Joker. Everyone said, wow. And so I says to myself, uh, that's not bad. Let me show you something. And being a boy, I wanted to show that I could make a better Joker. Uh, well, I didn't. Uh, but in my mind, I surely did. <laughs> I remember making the grin so huge. That's probably, like, my first memory of drawing. Funny. It's a uh, competitive drawing. Now, if I go to my memory museum, hmm... One time in the first or second grade, during a math pop quiz, I drew these two hearts kissing over the math problems. I had no idea what the answers were, so I thought that would fly. I had to stay after class, but, uh, hmm, probably, uh, splattered, painted a turkey like everyone else, uh, with, with, with fingers. Hmm. I cannot recall now. I'm calling out. Uh, huh. huh. Before all of this, I had been secretly drawing girls since... Oh, I cannot remember. It feels like lifetimes. It is so long, 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 long. Instead of telling a girl with words like, Hi, I like you. Which I did. And when I tried, failed miserably. So I learned that approach to telling a girl that you like her does not work in my case. Uh -huh. Instead, I draw pictures like in uh, Benny and June, the movie, you know, when uh, Mary Stuart Masterson 
draws Sam, you know, Johnny Deep, asleep. Uh, that's what I do. Oh, and uh, I iron cheese sandwiches. <laughs> do cats lay by windows? You do bring up a good point. I'm just a romantic type. <laughs> Furniture was born when I returned from Berlin. I felt confident to show drawings online since I had been doing secret drawings for so long. The word burniture, that's funny. Hmm. I thought I created a word. It was a Dada movement. I mean, Dada moment. I came to find that I comfortably painted on the floor. It feels good. Uh, my legs get numb. Gotta go walk it off. So I googled burniture, and it turns out it was a thing. You know, people burning furniture. Like some kind of woodsy ritual. It was so neat. So I says to myself, Yeah, I do that. And I serve these burnitures on a silver platter, a burning spirit violin, you know, sincerity. I really love the idea that people are brave enough to show themselves on the internet. It's Happy and sad pics, you know, celebration, study the photo, and the mood, I guess, comes to me quickly. Generally, how quickly do you... Empathy for the happiness or sadness, or whatever feeling happens in photos, uh, like I want to be there and show some love right back. I won't ever be rich, thou artist, but I am wealthy for the responses I have received. Well, I've never heard it put that way before. And I am just so astounded by what everyone brings. The levitation, the journey table people create. If I ever painted you, sees you, you've been a great influencer. I look to you like a mirror. I am outside on the curb. A galaxy fan giveaway. <laughs> We are very much graced with the presence of this eccentric artist type. The pink moon is the full moon of March. This so in 18 the 31st. Witches, scientists, friends who look into space trances know. Me, I draw parallels to Nick Drake's seminal masterstroke, Pink Moon. Delicacy in craft perfected. Though his health had been declining, and he gave it a go. Sad, tragic, and yet wonder. Beautiful. Ted's story of how he slumps into the record company and just hands them Pink Moon like here. Here you go. But people talk during his songs. He is very brave to go and put it out there. I tried, or at least fell into an everything in its right place type situation and brought my blue bathrobe. Yet, something is is missing. The order's all fluffed up. I don't remember what the... This is not my first interview, I'll let you know. This is actually... I've been 
the acoustics in this room are absolutely a trifle to deal with. Uh, I've been in much more dire interviews than this one. I've interviewed cocaine kingpins, so the likes of such a their artist is actually quite interesting to me to interview. I uh, like to hear myself speak, and the uh, fern is a... Uh, Yet, yet, something, something is, is, is missing. missing. Ah, I've had a dream, is a living room. Horsons, scarlet run rockets, play violin in space, space station. Tears of joy pouring downward. Drinking coffee with all the friends. Watching the earth heal and the moon. Oh, Julie Lundin sang in her silver dress. She sang her heart on the piano while the teens lay on the Spectacular hot sensation.